What's up guys, welcome to the channel. Today's video I'm gonna share with you my new kayak that I just picked up over the weekend. I'm gonna go over every single mod that I have in store for it that we're gonna do right here on my channel. And we're also gonna be saying goodbye to our old friend Nemo. Check it out. All right, guys, so before we get into the video today, I just want to let you guys know the new merch is in. I've got t-shirts, hoodies, decals. I'll have it linked in the very top of this video description. Click on it and check them out. They all, I have different colors. I've got the black one on right now. I love the logo. It, it looks really good where I'm getting them made at. Uh, if you want to support the channel, you can click that top link and get you a shirt, a hoodie, a, a sticker, whatever you want to get. It'll help support the channel, and we can just make more and more of these DIY mod videos of these kayaks. So. A lot of you guys know that I've been building this Vibe Seaghost, Old Nemo. I've been building her for about a year now. I've done just about every mod you can think of, from the trolling motor to the Bigsby steering to the Mod Pod to Anchor Trolley, just about everything you can do to it. And I've kind of maxed out on what you could actually do to a kayak. I mean, I've made videos for just about every single thing. and. In my last video, I let you guys know that I was probably going to get rid of it. I needed to start fresh on the channel for you guys so I can do more mods and different things. Uh, couldn't really do anything else to old Nemo there. So a lot of you guys who follow me on Instagram, you already know I kind of spoiled it this weekend. Uh, I did find me a kayak. It was two states away. I had to travel. I took off work Thursday, and we drove up to almost North Carolina to pick it up. And I've got it. Uh, I took a lot of pictures on Instagram after you guys kind of found out what I was doing this weekend and I just started sharing pictures of it on my Instagram. Make sure if you're not following me on Instagram you can check it. The link will be in the video description. Go follow me over there so you can get sneak peeks of when I do stuff like that. I like to share it with uh, all my Instagram followers. But I did get a new kayak. Uh, got rid of Old Nemo. It was hard to get rid of her. I really love the kayak. I still love Vibe. I'm still going to probably be a part of the Vibe community because my wife wants the maverick so we're probably going to get her the maverick and i'm going to be modding it out this summer as well but the wait is over i want to show you guys what i got it's in here in the garage Here she is. It is a 2014 Hobie Pro Angler 12, and I freaking love it. I got a chance to take it out this weekend to give it a good test run. We took it to Lake Gunnersville, and I got to pedal around the lake a whole lot, and it just it blows my mind how awesome of a boat this is. It is completely stock, just like I said I wanted. It has no upgrades at all. The fish finder you see is my original Lawrence Hook 25 that I had on Nemo. I did keep it. Uh, I found this boat in North Carolina. Thursday, I actually took off work, did a 10-hour round trip. We drove up almost to North Carolina, uh, and I met up with a guy. He traded me for Nemo. He, he was super pumped to get Nemo with the motor on the back, and I was super pumped to get the Hobie. So I made the round trip. I traded him, got it back home, and now I'm ready to share some upgrades with you guys. I've got a lot of cool things in store for this boat. I have not left my vibe community guys i promise like i said my wife wants the maverick we're going to add that maverick to our family and i'm going to be doing upgrades on it as well so my vibe guys i still love you i still love the seaghost 130 for a paddle boat the seaghost 130 i still believe is the best boat out there for a paddle boat you really can't compare it to a mirage drive it's just two completely different levels of kayaks but like i said for a paddle boat stick with if you're sticking with a paddle boat you did not go wrong by going with the Vibe Seaghost 130. I promise. And I can't wait to get my hands on the Maverick. My wife won't see it. We're going to be doing some really cool upgrades of it as well. But this week, I wanted to let you guys know the kayak trailer. You know, I bought this boat trailer I shared with you guys probably a month ago. And I've been planning on doing a lot of mods and upgrades to it. But I think in the back of my mind, I knew that I didn't want to build it specific yet just for Nemo. Because 
I knew that I probably was going to get one of these and I wanted to make sure I had room, you know, to add the Hobie and add different things. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to be making a playlist probably starting this week. I'll probably start filming tomorrow of us building this kayak trailer. Uh, it's not going to be like my old kayak trailer, the one I built two years ago. It, the, my last kayak trailer I built, as you guys know, it was built to haul multiple kayaks and you kind of had to pick them up and load them back on and it does great. I love it. This trailer is going to be built so that I can launch and load just like a bass boat. And I've got big plans for the sides of this kayak. Uh, I'm going to add a rod pod down one side for us to store rods and lock them on one side of the boat. But I didn't see the need for two rod pods. So what I plan to do is on one side I'm going to have the rod pod and on the other side I'm going to have another pod that looks just like a rod pod but I'm going to seal both ends up and it's going to be a fresh water tank and I'm going to have it so we can pressurize it with a little spiral hose that, that stays attached to the kayak trailer at all times and so when we go saltwater fishing or we go fishing and, and we get muddy or whatever when we load the boat back up on the trailer and I go to leave I should be able to just grab the hose completely wash the kayak off before we leave the river or the beach or wherever it we're, you know, wherever I'm at fishing, it should be able to do it. And there's a few other things I'm going to add to the trailer. We're going to powder coat some stuff. We're going to paint the trailer. And I'm going to build it right here on the channel with you guys every step of the way. I'll make a playlist. Uh, I'm also going to be working on the mothership. If you're new to my channel and you don't know what the Kayak USA mothership is, check out the playlist. I've got it right here on the channel. I bought a pontoon boat last year, and we've been slowly stripping it down and building it up to an awesome mothership. Uh, it's going to be something where we take it out on the lake anchor it off, have the kayaks tied off to the side and camp and sleep, you know, right there on the boat. It's really cool. But I'm going to be working on it this week. We're getting it registered. I'm finally going to get the winch, the electric winch installed on the front of that. And we're going to be, i got a lot of cool things coming. I, a lot of really cool things coming. I've got so many different things going on right now. I don't know which video to shoot first for you guys, so I'm trying to pace myself. But we are definitely going to be doing a lot of mods and upgrades to the old Hobie here. I haven't got a name for it yet, and I've been, <laughs> I've got a lot of guys on Instagram right now, AZ, uh, the Arizona guy, <laughs> he's, he give it a name that we're probably not going to stick with, but I'm, I don't know, I might end up getting stuck with this name, but they're, they're already calling it the old banana boat, but I don't want to call it the banana boat, yes, I know it's yellow, yes, I know it looks like a banana, but we've got a better, we got to find a better name for it. Nemo was an awesome name, you guys picked out Nemo for me back when I bought the Vibe last year. And so let's come up with a really cool name, Arizona guy, not Banana Boat, all right? <laughs> all right, guys, so this is the Pro Angler that I just picked up. Stay tuned for some awesome mods. A lot of awesome adventure videos are coming up this spring for you guys. All right, guys, so if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you haven't seen all of my other videos, check them out. I got DIY videos, adventure videos, kayak camping videos, all kind of stuff right here on the channel. Become a member of the Yak Squad. Make sure you check out the merch if you want some Kayak USA t-shirts and hoodies and stickers. Top link in the video description, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.